For the first time ever, scientists say they have found evidence there could be a way to delay Alzheimer's symptoms in people who are genetically more likely to develop the disease in their 40s or 50s. In a small trial from Washington University in St. Louis, scientists found evidence an experimental drug that removes amyloid plaques can delay the onset of Alzheimer's if started early enough in life. Amyloid plaques are abnormal protein deposits that accumulate in the brain. Researchers tested the amyloid-removing therapies in a group of 73 people who have rare genetic mutations that make it almost certain they will develop Alzheimer's. The new study, published Wednesday in the journal Lancet Neurology, found that the risk of symptoms was cut in half for a small subset of 22 patients who had not shown any problems with memory or thinking and had been taking an amyloid-lowering drug for an average of eight years. Researchers say while these results are promising, much more testing still needs to be done. That might not be so easy, however, due to research cuts and funding delays from the Trump administration. The research team says meetings to review their National Institutes of Health grant funding have been canceled twice now. Their grant must be reviewed before they can be referred to what's known as a council meeting where funding decisions are made. If their grant misses a council meeting in May, the money for this study, which has been going on since 2008, could run out. For more unbiased updates, download the Straight Arrow News app or go to san.com.